everyone, and welcome to Dragon Ball Z League 2023 season, week 12, episode 4, matches 7 and 8, the final matches of the week. I'm Ryan. And Summer. Yes, the sibling stream is still going on. Ah, so, yes. we've had some crazy matches, and uh, this match will have some implication. Uh, so we have Budokai at eight and three, GT at six and five. GT is kind of, kind of fighting for the top of their division right now. Uh, if Budokai wins, they still can make it to the top of their division. But if Budokai loses, spoiler alert here, Boo Saga will now have the bye week for their division. So fortunately, even if we, even if Budokai doesn't win, they're still guaranteed playoff spot. Yes, because we got best girl Videl. I, I, I do love Best Girl Fidel. She is, she is my favorite. <laughs> She's running. P plus one Broken Glow, Power Rage on Krillin AI, and Super Saiyan 4 Vegeta is... Uh, nope, that's Baby in... Vegeta. Oh, wait. No, sorry. He's the bench. Uh, super really old man Vegeta is running a Tech plus one series, Dragon Power, Dende's Healing, and Piccolo AI. Dragon's oh, Impact right away. The Broken Glow makes her rushes half a bar if they miss. <laughs> that is fantastic. That is... I mean, granted, she still needs to get to two bars in order to use one of hers, but the fact it only yeah. costs half a bar, essentially... Yeah, because oh, it, it, it sees the cost um, before the cars are factored in. Correct. Um... Which is all right, because, you know, you you want to have key even at any point. Uh, recommendation for a costume, if the modders are listening. Uh, it's not my favorite costume, but um, Ooh, uh, Battle like of the Gods Fidel costume would be nice. I don't remember what that looked like. It was like a red sort of dress when she was... Uh, not visibly pregnant with uh, Pam. All right, right, But uh, um, I like that outfit. Yeah, her I like hair that outfit too. But Videl, uh, show why you're the best girl. You, you got to do, do stuff. Do something. That'll help. Flashing is good. Flashing 87. is great. That won't. And oh, After nice image. dodge. She's got oh, a tag, tag, tag. Yeah, tag would be great. You are at the very limits of your health. She's doing great on one health. <laughs> and dead. <laughs> Bye. All right. In comes early Piccolo running attack plus one series, quick fast attack, eternal life, and Trunks AI. He has been showing some real potential this season because um, he was... Not great before, and I'll just say, Havoc has really, really tuned up Piccolo and made him Uzi. Yeah, uh, early Piccolo is 12th in the league, 56k, in which prior seasons, whether he was on uh, Resurrected Warriors or Namek, uh, you know, 20, 25k, he was very low. So. Another um, another come from Grace, but wow, uh, Super Baby Vegeta, er, hi. Yeah, early, okay, early Piccolo avoids the fodder award. Okay, he gets some damage in, that's good. Um, <laughs> um, Vegeta might be he trying was, for an elite. <laughs> yeah, he was, he was just like doing nothing to Vegeta here and uh, still kind of doing not much of anything. No, he's done maybe um, a bar. Um, Baby Vegeta does have Blast Ox. He could go into Super Baby 2. Yep. Super old Vegeta 2. Let's do it. Gallic Gun's going to eliminate. Yep. Oh. Um, it's very that was, possible. Depending that was on easily early Piccolo's worst performance this season so far. Yeah. Um, Supreme Kai is in running Super Plus 1. Eats a final flash. Um, Power of Rage, Launch of Sport, Fighting Spirit, Indignation, Piccolo AI. Um, I think... All I, right. I, because you had healing on 
Piccolo. I don't believe there was heal. Oh, no. And uh, he's Big Monkey. I think uh, once he no does good. this bar of Supreme Kai, that's an elite for GP. I think it might be. Um, yeah, I don't recall any health pushbacks or anything, so... Uh, no. Gigantic Flame, that, that's going to yeah. guarantee it. Yeah. yeah. GT with an um, elite. A clean elite. Um, all right, so... Uh, oh, wow. Let's... Let's just say Budokai is uh, happily going to say we have a playoff spot, and that's all that matters. <laughs> um, Adult Gohan is in. He's running Super Plus 2, Key Minus 1, Indignation, Savior, Dende's Healing, Fighting Spirit, Dragon Spirit, and Piccolo AI. Hey, Super um, Kamehameha. It got slightly... and um... takes... Okay, hey, look. Old Vegeta did not sweep the whole team. <laughs> well, you know what could happen? We could have double elites. Roshi is in. Actually, no, this is Jackie Chun. He's running Key Plus 2, Super Minus 1, Power Rage, Dende's Healing, Indignation, Savior, Kamido Secret Art as a boost, and Yajirobe AI. Please accept my apologize. apologies, Mr. Chun. <laughs> um, so, it is possible. Um, I'm not going to say it's oh, yeah. likely, but it's possible. We could see an elite from Gohan. So, oh, yeah. You wouldn't be eliminated, but uh, that is that's another hundred and twenty thousand that Gohan has to do in order to win. Yeah. So it's it's it is possible for uh, Budokai to still win this one, but it is I will just say unlikely. Very unlikely. This is going to be Gohan's you know underdog story episode. Can he do it? I mean, he is, he is a higher tier FA, so it would make sense if he could be the one to pull it back. Unleash your potential, Gohan. Yes, do your full power charges. Explosive Go Madonna. Beast. Wow, very nice. Gohan Beast. I I mean, yeah. Which has <laughs> ridiculous hair. <laughs> I, I saw the picture of the hair. That is, that is like, insanity. Yeah. Like, something it's, you would expect from, like, a Super Saiyan 7. <laughs> it's, it's his hair from Super Saiyan 2 teen, just, you know, different color and really tall. Yeah, that is true, yeah. I don't know if I'm a fan of, like, Orange Piccolo, though. Like... I cannot tell the difference between Orange Piccolo and Regular Piccolo, so... Your yeah. color blindness goes orange-green? Really? A little bit, yeah. The red-green... Oh. It makes it hard to tell. Well, um, all right. He's eliminated Roshi, so he's at like a 55 because Roshi had healing. Um, How dare you call him Roshi? That's sorry. Jackie Chun. Jackie Chun, you're right. Uh, In it comes is... Dr. Jiro. Eats 9K. Super plus one, high tension, hatred of Saiyans, key control, Goku AI. Jiro, do you know that Gohan's a Saiyan? You hate I, him. I think he does, <laughs> yes. <laughs> Okay, put that hatred to use. It's like he is. Nope. Did not get. Uh, did not use a V two or anything. Although, with this I mean, he still edge. still grabbed him. Yeah. He is keeping Gohan's key down, which is probably the most important thing. Yeah, Gohan having key makes Gohan dangerous, and Gohan has gone Golden Warrior on us. All right, Energy Blast Volley. Now, Jiro could absorb some of this, you know. If he wanted. If he wanted. He won't, but, you know, if he wanted. Does, does he want to? That's a good question. Um, ooh. I'm going to... Nope, that's not going to work. Oh, that, that, yeah. I think uh, Jiro goes down here in a minute. But, uh... Gohan has a tough road against Sin Shenron. Defense plus three, attack minus one, eternal life, and savior on Vegeta AI. Um, it, I mean, I'm going to say really... it's very possible Gohan has gotten an elite, um, but I don't think he's going to win. Yeah, Stand I, still, I... please. Hit him. Hit him. Hit him. No. <laughs> oh. He tried to not stand still. But so, he didn't not stand still enough. So we have think, a guaranteed elite in that match of Baby Vegeta. 
a potential elite from Adult Gohan. Uh, GT wins, which does put them, I believe, at the top of their division right now. Uh, I think he did get an elite, though, because it's gonna, it's gonna there be was, very close. He had all, he got more than just over a bar of Amy Vegeta. He had all of Jackie Chun, who had healing, all of Jiro. And then a little bit like, on Sin. So if he yeah. does not make it, like, if he doesn't make it, I'm thinking it's going to be by, like, 2,000 points. Like, yeah. And if he does make it, it's going to be by, like, 1,000 points. Something yeah. he was, stupid like that. <laughs> he was just on. He's, like, right on the edge. It might be the closest non-elite ever or the fairest elite. Yeah. But we have one more match, which involves Cold Kingdom and Earth Defenders. Cold Kingdom is currently seven and four. Earth Defenders are six and five. Earth, Def Oop. Uh, Earth Defenders want the win uh, so that they can stay up with uh, GT. Cold wants the win so that they can stay up near Royals uh, for their uh, whole divisional shtick. That, that's basically it. Uh, I mean, they're also... I don't think any of them can be eliminated now, but, you know, it's a, it's a whole thing. All right. Well, let's get to them. Oh, is it not showing for you? Nope. <laughs> there you go. There we go. All right. Zarbon starting things off for Cold Kingdom. Running Defense Plus 2, Dende Ceiling, Seriously, and Energy Quick Pass Attack on Piccolo AI, Krillin is leading off with Defense Plus 2, Dende Ceiling, Serious Quick Fast Attack, Light Body on Majin Buu AI. Um, those are the same builds other than the AI. So who does it better, basically? Yep, and by default, I'm going to guess Krillin, just because Krillin has a lot of history being used with builds like this. Yeah, Krillin, Krillin, Fasha, Kid Trunks, some of the better of the um, melee I mean, masters. I want to say some characters really have not had to, probably haven't had to change up too hard what their um, core concept is, even from the early, early original league. Like, they've just been solid and shown potential with core elements of their builds right away. Yeah. And it's just been iterating and tinkering and tweaking from there. Something happened during that melee combo. I saw okay. Krillin's key bars go down two. And I don't, I don't know why, because he didn't do any key. I don't know what he did, but uh, he did try and solar flare the back of Zarbon's head. I mean, you know, uh, a good fighter has eyes in the back of his head. And he nice eats that command man for on that day. good charging by Krillin, and uh, he scared um, Zarbon out. Now it's the Battle of Pizzas. I do like pizza. Um, I kind of want to. Hey, he's. 100% Final Form Frieza is in. Attack plus two, defense minus one. Kabito Secret Arch says a boost. Power Raid, Sirius, Fighting Spirit, Light Body, Savior on Tunkei. You forgot your pizza! That's Krillin's move! Yeah, but he only throws two because he knows that a normal family only needs two pizzas. Krillin, show what a giant, you know, what a, um family like uh kate plus eight like does. ours does. oh never mind no show like our family does because we do eat lots of pizza yeah i i can down an entire red baron by myself <laughs> me two of those <laughs> and uh in comes vegeta base and vegeta key plus one dende's healing series quick fast attack fighting spirit indignation shout to ai um Cold Kingdom is in the lead here, um, health-wise. M tag wise because, uh, Krillin went down. Zarbon tag, yeah. Um, yep, we're, do we're doing a bit of 
you know, flying around. Oh, you know, got away from the long yeah, every, waited. Kind everyone, of smart yeah, every. Oh, oh that's really smart. Cuts Cole connects right through them. 15k. He's locked off. Every, yeah, and that's gonna give him a chance to manually charge up and not worry about uh, having to uh, B1 his way back to max. Look I was hoping he would he would get rid of the charge penalty and then just B1 anyway. <laughs> That would be silly okay. and There's entirely Vegeta. in keeping with the AI. All right, okay, Vegeta. Vegeta's somewhere. There he is. What are you all doing? The other end of the, map. <laughs> the the I can't do a transformation. I need to pee dance. <laughs> oh, that was really funny. Uh, Normally, I'd want to transform at this point, but I can't because you filthy Earthlings stopped me. <laughs> I feel back uh, to max power again. You forgot your pizza. Forgot your and... pizza, and well, all right. Vegeta did not go down. Uh, now he, he did. Is not... Okay, pizza break for Vegeta. Um, oh my goodness. <laughs> pole is in. Earth defenders are leading the pole, seventy-five twenty-five. But uh, the real map tells a different story so far. Holy crap! Base mid Goku is in. Super plus one. Vegeta secret art. Dragon Spirit Savior, Indignation, Light Body, Yadirobi AI, a Spirit Bomb to take out Frieza, 15 and a half K. That's necessary for Earth Defenders. Golden Mecha Frieza, Defense plus three, Attack minus one, Savior, Indignation, Light Body, Launches Support, and the Jivi the 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 AI. His AI is vegetables. Mm, vegetables. Uh, Supernova. Supernova. Yep. Ooh, on the 14 on the Kaioken. 14 and a half right there and uh Goku's like bye. Hey, you know what? Tags uh Yeah. He's still in Tags his third bar. He might have just barely been. He had uh he has no healing other than the tag. So uh Namzin attack plus 2 Defense minus one, eternal life, power, rage, and Gohan AI. Tried and true, simple, basic nom build. I mean, yeah, another great just melee monster. Yeah. It's, he's, and cross arms. Oh. Yeah, he's one of those characters who, ever since the early, early league, has just, you know, been able to do monstrous amounts of damage. And here he is, just, uh, you know. Doing some good work, chewing through Frieza. And they they need it, uh, cause the Cold Kingdom does have um uh the tag advantage right now. Oh yeah. Nam's moves should all be water themed. I want one to be named like the Life Aquatic with Steve Namzu. Okay. <laughs> uh, if, if, if there was a way to like modify moves, um, like like, like his B two names. Yeah, if, if there was a way to like modify just moves in general, have him take a selfie with somebody and name it Thirst Trap, and then Thirst it damages Trap them from be... how good looking Nam is. Thirst Trap should absolutely be what his other. Uh, B2 name is Monster Zarbon. Hello, Zarbon has gone beautiful. <laughs> One of my favorite um, what if scenarios because in the um, I think it was Budokai Tenkaichi 3 actually, uh, there was a what if scenario of what if Zarbon betrayed he broke him. Ooh, yeah, that'll, that'll actually help him. the Cold Kingdom out right now. Yeah. Uh, Zarbon was uh, was uh, starting to uh, have a bit of trouble against Nam, and that key break really helped. Ooh, and that wild pressure helps. Yeah, that's gonna be good damage. He got and a tag. He, he got he got a B two. He got a tag. He he used that uh, key break to very good effect. 
Uh, Mercenary Talzin, People has One Dragon Power, Dende's Healing, Fighting Spirit on Chiatsu AI. Uh, you were saying about a what if scenario? So in Budokai, in Budokai Tenkaichi 3, I believe there was a what if scenario where Zarbon decides to betray Frieza and uh, go get the Dragon Balls himself. And his ultimate, <laughs> what he ends up wishing for is eternal beauty. <laughs> Yes, I remember that. <laughs> and Nam, it took all that time for Nam to finally die, but he did. Tag um, health advantage okay. to cold right now. Uh, I like the little pose Nam does with for the villagers. For the villagers should be the one that gets renamed Thirst Trap because it looks like he's, you know, posing for a selfie. Okay, that's that's not a bad one. Ooh, 20k spear 20K. bomb. 20k. Jeez. Goku can do a bunch of those, too. He can now I'm mad got no healing he needs to do this because uh in a minute here he's about to have it roughly even on health yeah and then any like uh it's gonna be a, like goku has to use his b1s to get a really how's gonna there. win that yeah he needs to start using them he needs to transform uh, i don't think he's gonna get the chance i think ping pong's gonna take yeah. him out nope Oh, misses the Dodonpa, he falls, throws out a little bit of melee, a little bit more, and Can he a get little rid bit of... more. Got rid okay. of Tao. Okay, use your B2, B1s, man. If he uses B1, Dude. Zarbon's just going to hit him. Transformation's not bad. Yeah. Zarbon, counter. You have part. the key to counter. Like... Uh-oh. Um, okay. okay. Who's this oh, go to? Okay. Garbon wins and pay it. All right. Cold Kingdom wins. A very close match at the end. Yeah, a very, like, that could have, if, if Goku won, Goku won that clash, Goku could have gotten that for Earth Defenders. Uh, it really yeah. came down to that clash. But wow, it that really was, was. I think that was our closest match this week. <laughs> yes, that was definitely the closest match of the week. And, uh, the other thing we learned is we also learned uh, what Noms for the Villagers rename should be in the future. AKA Thirst Trap. <laughs> yes. Mods, right. can you put a little cell phone in his hand when he does that one? I don't think they can add assets. That's the only thing. Damn. Uh, uh, even without, he's still posing for one. Yes. <laughs> so that is going to be it for this uh, episode. Make sure to do your usual YouTube thing of liking, subscribing, ringing the bell. Check out links in the description below for our TikTok, our Twitter, our Discord, and our website so you can learn more about the league, uh, talk to more people about the league, you know, and just have some fun. Uh, we have three yeah. more weeks left of the main season. Then we're going to have a small off-season event, and then uh, the we start the whole playoff contention. So, thanks for watching, guys. I appreciate it, and I will, or er, and I've been Ryan. I have been Summer. See you next week. Bye-bye yes. now. Bye-bye.